Okay, I got a question from somebody. He wasn't really figuring out how to set up a synthesizer here in Acid Music Studio. Uh, it's a little bit different if you're using Acid Pro, but it's the same basic thing. I believe the only difference is in uh, really where you go to set things up. Uh, you might need to make this folder. It's you put it in this under the C drive, the program files, and then VST plugins or something similar. Okay, and then that's just where you put all your plugins and VSTi instruments, the VST instruments. Okay, and then in Acid Music Studio itself, uh, I believe on Pro there's a, a button down here that you would click on. It's down here by the where you view all your samples and stuff in the window. I believe that's where you uh, tell it what folders to look at for VSTs and VSTIs. But on Music Studio, uh, it just defaults to the VST, uh, VST plugins, so everything is in there. So you just come there and then uh, insert soft synth, and soft synth, and all the ones that you've got in that folder will be there. Okay, but if you're just using the default one right here, you can also come over to pian the where it says Piano One, and that'll have all the options for the different sounds that the default the default synthesizer comes with. Uh, you can also come to preferences and there will be VST instruments and VST effects. <coughs> Pardon me. And uh, that's where you load them all in. Or uh, really, it loads them automatically when you start the program. So the easiest way to do it so you don't have to sit and wait for a long time because it's faster when it's first loading up instead of when the program's already running. Uh, put all the stuff you want to add in all the VST effects and all the VST instruments into that folder or again I forgot to show you uh, you can use different folders this one allows up to three folders for all that stuff so you can have one for effects one for instruments if you want or wherever it doesn't matter and just put them in there and then start the program and it'll load them up automatically so yeah it's not hard uh, to do, you just have to, you know, go do a search for like free VST, free VSTIs, um, and that'll find you some stuff for free. Pretty much, I'm, almost all of the plugins I use I got for free, and they do a decent enough job. So, yeah, that's, uh, that's a quick little heads up on that. There you go. Thanks for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Bye. I don't want to do